it's really good to be back. Uh, today we're celebrating. We don't get many celebrations in this kind of work. Uh, there weren't many of us to begin with, but it's just incredible to be standing here with so many of my former colleagues. You will see that this is one of those rare issues that unites people across the political spectrum. You can tell that just from the people assembled here this morning. I want to pay credit to the parliamentary friends of Julian Assange for bringing him home. They brought him home. Also because they're here to the incredible sharp legal representation that Julian has had through this, this long campaign. Uh, and I, would, I do want to acknowledge the Albanese government. It's a, an example of a government leading from the front. The diplomatic work, some of it behind the scenes, some of it in public, the fact that we were able to unite people from across the political spectrum, it's, it's a real credit. It is also about some of the work that goes on that's maybe a little bit less visible from in here, people who are organising rallies and banner drops in 2011, people who signed petitions. You know, it was a global grassroots movement that gave us the momentum, that gave that impetus to the diplomatic work that's got us over the line uh, once and for all. And ultimately, this is about you. If you're in here with a camera or a press pass, Julian has done this for you. Him and his colleagues knew exactly what they were walking into. They knew the risks that they were taking, and they did it anyway. And they did it in part to protect your right to do your job, to inform us about what government is doing in our name. So we're celebrating. For me, that celebration is tempered by the fact that the United States government, our supposed ally, was willing to torture an Australian citizen and one of your colleagues for 14 years, and that it took a global movement to get him out. So we are celebrating, but I feel as though we also need to have in our minds, forefront in our minds today, what about the other whistleblowers? What about the other journalists? What about the other publishers? This is about all of us collectively. One chapter ends, thank God, and another one begins. Thanks all for being here. Thank you.